I was knocked down, heard the countdown through the haze in the face of defeat, yeah. I was ruled out with no bail out on my own, all alone, left to bleed out. A beautiful day. It was stormy all day yesterday. Still beautiful, but the water is the most beautiful color to me in the entire world. This is paradise. So happy to be here. Better a toast at the beach than sitting inside for the last six months. <laughs> yeah. Go, go. And the sand is like powder white. It's really fine and soft. The water is so clear. You can see everything below you. And when we first got here again, the sun was a bit higher into the sky. So everything was just like sparkling, which is my favorite color. I don't know, is anybody else out there like a turquoise fan? <laughs> it's always been the color that makes me the happiest. Highly recommend coming to the free beach. It's like half a mile south of the ruins. Bring yourself a cooler of snacks and drinks and just enjoy. For permission, no. Yes, uh, the name of that the, in Maya is Arush. Arush is a uh, little guy like this. Many people can see that this uh, little god. You know, they take care for all around to the cenotes because when you find a cenote like this, uh, any cenotes, you have to make a really nice ceremony, right? For to asking if it's possible to open the cenotes if it's possible to work at the cenotes, if it's possible to people uh, visit all around. Because if you do not do it, 
and you can have a many accidents almost every time. Some people they can sink, some people they can uh, walk and just like uh, fail and everything like that. So it's very important to do that. And do you do that here? Yes. Very cool. <laughs>
y se convierte en un halcón nave. One of the first ruins we ever came to in Mexico. This was sort of a fort for the Maya Empire because it's situated right on top of like a rocky cliff overlooking the Caribbean Sea. And so they could see like if any enemies or people were coming. And there's also lots of different temples. So there's two temples on the bottom, one temple on the top. And this one is the most decorative preserved in this whole area. You can still see like red paint remnants. They used to paint all the pyramids red. So it's really cool. So this is the main um, temple called El Castillo, or the castle. And it's really big, imposing structure. Onto the private beach, you have to go through this sludge. 